Hey there, my name is Frank Caron, and I'm an experienced engineer for financial services here at Salesforce. I'm super excited today to be able to talk to you a little bit more about Experience Cloud this year at Dreamforce to you. Experience Cloud is one of our most exciting areas of development, and we've got some really, really cool stuff to share with you this year. Now, before we get too far ahead of ourselves, in typical Salesforce fashion, especially here where we're at Dreamforce time, please, any buying decisions that come out of conversations with us have to be based on what's in the product today. Now, on to the more important ritual of our presentations, the thank you. We are super grateful for your time and attention, and if you're watching this video, it means you are super important to us, and uh, you think as highly, hopefully, of us as we think of you. So thank you so much for your time. We're really looking forward to telling you a little bit more about Experience Cloud today. Now, we like to start these conversations by level setting on the problem space we're trying to solve for. And one of the things that we've noticed over the years in working with our closest banking customers and partners is that many of our customers are struggling from what we've come to call the gap. With a bunch of different digital experience systems and properties, a dot-com website, a lending portal, an online banking portal, and beyond, our financial service customers in the banking space are struggling with disconnected experiences and importantly, a front office that doesn't really connect neatly to the mid and back office that give that front office purpose. This creates friction in the customer experience and negatively affects everything from customer retention to net new customer acquisition and cross-sell. In fact, it's this exact problem that we're trying to solve for with Experience Cloud, our single solution for connected financial service customer experiences. Experience Cloud is our tool for seamless, connected digital experience management. It allows our customers to build websites, portals, and mobile applications quickly, and to connect those front office applications to their mid and back office process automation, analytics, and business orchestration seamlessly, simply, and quickly. In fact, Experience Cloud and its ability to rapidly deliver connected digital experience is exactly the kind of thing that helped us help our financial service customers during everything that's happened this year. The SBA PPP situation was just one of many different initiatives that our banking customers had to deal with. And examples like Mascoma Bank are sterling ones for how Experience Cloud can enable our customers to rapidly iterate on a digital experience and deliver one to the end customers with connectivity to their existing processes, data, and integrations to the core uh, very, very simply and easily. Now there's a lot to understand about Experience Cloud from a functionality perspective, but we really like to think about it as the single digital experience management tool that will help you build the prospect to customer experience. So from the moment you're working to convert a net new customer and engage them and educate them on your brand to that transition from prospect to customer where they register and are onboarded and then to their continued customership with you where they're served and learn more and expand their service offerings and, and product acquisition from you. All of those parts of the puzzle uh, are meant to be solved for with Experience Cloud. So rather than talk feature function, we thought it'd be a great idea to show you a quick demo of what Experience Cloud can do. So we're gonna put ourselves in the seat of Julie Morris, a small business owner who's gone off to Google at, to research a new small business loan. She believes that now is the right time to take advantage of the market in prepping for everything good that's gonna to happen to us all hopefully next year. And so she's gone out to Google to search for a new uh, commercial loan for her business. Now in doing so, she immediately finds bank.com well ranked in the search results in her local area. Having found that ad, she clicks over to bank.com where she's met with a completely open-ended, unauthenticated experience. Here, she can learn a ton more about bank.com. And because she's coming to the website from New York City, 
some of the content that she's being presented with is actually being tailored directly to her. However, she wants to get at this loan. So she begins going through a very streamlined and slick qualification process where the site actually gets some basic information from her and helps to get her through that process of understanding which products and services might be a fit. She's prompted with some options based on what she had been previously searching. And as she selects an option, the power of the Salesforce platform and Einstein are using what we know to present her with an option that we think makes a lot of sense. She was searching for a small line of credit for her business. And so that makes a lot of sense to offer her up. We then give her the chance to provide a few more details. And at that point, we've qualified and captured that new lead turning her directly into an authenticated potential customer and providing her with a further personalized experience. Now at this point, with her prospect information, we can further tailor the content. We know now she's a small business owner and she's looking for that line of credit. And we can also present to her contextual actions in addition to that content that help her be successful. We can give her the ability to very quickly complete her existing application and go through the onboarding process. Or we can even offer her up another potential offer now that we have some idea of what she's interested in that may be complementary to that line of credit. In this case though, Julie is focused on completing her application. So she goes ahead and navigates directly into the complete my application process. Now this gives her the option to be taken through a very guided process uh, with simple steps that make it easy for her to input her business information and provide bank.com with everything they need to help her get her line of credit. This includes basic data entry and the validation that supports it to make sure she doesn't make a mistake and to streamline the process. And it also includes document upload, allowing her to actually provide the necessary qualifications for KYC as well as e-signature, which allows her to actually sign off on her submission right online without having to go into a branch or location. With this information, her application is now complete and she can sit back and wait for the bank.com team to follow up with her. Of course, Julie's a business owner and she's not one to wait around. So she decides that she's also going to take advantage of the option to schedule an appointment as well. Just like with the process for the application and the onboarding, Experience Cloud is going to actually help her guide through the process of booking an appointment. This allows her to use uh, the same kind of tools that might exist for a financial advisor to actually look at and schedule a meeting with the available advisors in her local area at her local branch, all directly on her own time in a self-service fashion uh, without picking up the phone. With that, her appointment is scheduled. Now at this point, she's got to get going. She's got an appointment with one of her customers later today. So she takes off and hops onto her mobile device where she can access a branded version from the App Store of Bank.com's customer experience. Everything she's seen and experienced on the desktop.com is also available on the mobile experience. And that actually includes some of the rich self-service features as well, like chat and phone calls directly integrated into the app. In this case, Julie decides she's going to reach out directly through the chat to a financial advisor. With the intention of streamlining that process, this chat experience can actually be equipped with a bot. And here we see Banksy, bank.com's bot which is doing the best it can to try to get Julie the information she needs as fast as possible. In this case though, she's clear she wants to talk to a human, she needs that human touch. Uh, so Banksy is able to actually route her directly to one of the financial advisors that's standing by and has the ability to provide her with service. In parallel to that, we're inside of the core financial service cloud product as one of those financial advisors. And that chat in real time prompts that financial advisor to begin the conversation with Julie. Now this conversation is not happening asynchronously. It's not happening by email. It's happening in real time between the financial advisor on his desktop computer and Julie out in the world through her cell phone. 
and their interactions are going to be tracked in Financial Service Cloud to allow continued support and success for Julie. Just as Julie was presented some offers and potential cross-sell opportunities, so too is our financial advisor, who has his own view of the potential offers that make sense for Julie based on her account. Of course, not only does the financial advisor have access to the chat and to those offers, he also has access to all of Julie's information, including that loan application that she just recently made. He can see the status of it, he can see that she's uploaded her documents and signed it, and he can even review those documents and the signature as well as all the details she's input. And that's also true for her service appointments. That appointment she made, he can see that too. All of this is tied to that 360 view of Julie and her business. And in validating that information, he can get back to Julie immediately without switching systems and make her confident and comfortable in being a bank.com customer. With that, Julie returns to her desktop later in the day, picks up where she left off. It's been a little while now, so she wants to double check the status of her loan application. And she can do that with the My Account page. Here, Julie can see all of the financial accounts that she has directly with Bank.com and any of the linked accounts from other providers or other systems within Bank.com's infrastructure. All of these can be presented to her in a single, clean view, alongside her pending applications as well. Now in this case, she decides that she actually wants to do a little work with a deposit account. That's something that's facilitated by Bank.com's backend systems, and specifically Q2, another tool in the financial service software ecosystem. Now typically, Q2 would require a separate login, uh, and that experience may unfortunately require the Bank.com customers like Julie to have multiple logins. But thanks to Experience Cloud, that's not the case. With a simple, single sign-on, Julie is instantly moved over to the Q2 experience and can move back and forth between the two without having to log in again. With that, Julie's completed everything she needs to do to feel like a valued customer today and is left satisfied with the connected, consistent experience of being a Bank.com customer. Now this is just a very small slice of the entire prospect to customer experience that Experience Cloud is designed to facilitate. And there are so many great reasons why Experience Cloud is an amazing choice for our financial service customers who are looking to build that next generation digital banking experience. Experience Cloud has been purposely crafted to make it easy to rapidly build pixel-perfect responsive websites and mobile applications. Our tools make it easy for our financial service customers in banking to get these sites up and to iterate on them. But just putting up a website is not enough, and that's why Experience Cloud also has a number of tools to help tailor that experience and personalize it to drive the right kinds of outcomes. Of course, that personalization in a vacuum isn't valuable if that front office experience isn't connected to the mid and back office. And that's where Experience Cloud's native connectivity to the Salesforce ecosystem makes it a powerhouse in creating a seamless, orchestrated, and connected experience. And when the out-of-the-box tools aren't enough, the entire ecosystem and strength of the Salesforce platform stands behind Experience Cloud. If you can do it on the core of Salesforce, you can do it in Experience Cloud. And that makes Experience Cloud one of the most powerful digital experience management tools in the world. Of course, if you can't tell, I'm very excited about what's happening with Experience Cloud, and there's so much to say. But we really look forward to you digging in with your hands-on. We've shared some links and some ideas about how you can get started and go hands-on. Trailhead is always an amazing resource. And we really encourage you to reach out to your account executives if you want to learn more. Myself and the entire team of solution engineers working on financial services are really excited to be partnering with banks and building amazing connected experience for banking customers. Thank you so much, and I hope you have an amazing Dreamforce to you.